Amazing technology hasn't passed up the boating and yachting world. Check out some amazing feats of engineering and innovation, even if they are pricey. Let's take a spin on the water in some of these amazing yachts and catamarans, shall we? First up, this one is quite extraordinary. The Tatiana, a 262-foot-long motor yacht that made its debut in 2021, showcasing the height of elegance and stunning extravagance. However, the superstructure and frame of the yacht consist entirely of aluminum and are clad by a super-reinforced steel hull that enables it to slice through the water. Get this, Tatiana is powered by two MTU Rolls-Royce engines that give her a cruising speed of about 12 knots, with a top speed of 19 knots. That's crazy for a yacht that size. Still, there's more. Designed for a crew of 24 plus, including the captain, the super yacht can accommodate up to 12 guests. Tatiana is on the top 200 list of world's largest yachts, but still not the largest, believe it or not. You gotta admit though, she looks quite awesome with her sleek exterior, not to mention her alluring H2 designed interior. The Tatiana last sold in 2022 for just under $100 million. Next up, this one is pretty incredible. Dubbed the Energy Observer, she's a beautiful redesigned catamaran for multi-purposes. Launched in 2017, she offers significant transport abilities and produces zero carbon emissions. Energy Observer is about 100 feet long and is covered with over 200 square feet of solar panels. What's even cooler is that she produces her own hydrogen using electrolysis and seawater. Add wind power to that and she has full energy autonomy. Energy Observer is currently four years into a seven-year around-the-world journey to prove that wind-slash-solar-slash-hydrogen yachts are viable. You can follow her at their website, energy-observer.org. She's also been key to testing and developing new technology, including the onboard hydrogen production and creating surplus energy from its three power sources to convert into stored hydrogen. The three power sources propel the ship and allow it to function at sea. On top of that, with her three power technologies, many view the Energy Observer as a laboratory built to explore the seas while helping ecologically sound progress. Let us know what you think. Check this beauty out. Kalila first hit the seas in 2015. Her impressive allure and elegant charm invites you right on board. She is the first super yacht made entirely from carbon. In other words, she's built like a brick house, as the old saying goes. <laughs> if that doesn't set her apart from the competition, her unique gold design does. Built by Palmer Johnson, she's 158 feet long. She can reach impressive speeds up to 26 knots with her dual MTU V16 Rolls-Royce motors, having a combined output of 5,200 horsepower. Now that's some power. Still, the beautiful pearlescent gold exterior isn't the only luxurious thing about Kalila. She was designed to meet all expectations without compromising herself. She has the speed, ample space, and accommodating sleek interior. She contains five rooms for up to 11 guests, including two master suites and three standard rooms. Kalila is operated by a nine-person crew, including the captain. As of 2021, Kalila was listed at just over $32 million mere pocket change. This is just flat out crazy. You're gonna wanna see this one. Dubbed the Phoenix 1000, she's the largest private yacht slash submarine ever built. You heard that right. Some say perhaps the most significant transportation development of the 21st century so far. A 213 foot long submersible yacht? Are you kidding me? designed for smoother traveling overseas because other yachts would have to face storms head-on and struggle with rough seas. But Phoenix can just dive underneath the water where she would be cruising smoothly at 16 knots. That is simply amazing. But check this out. The hull is surrounded by large windows so that guests see and experience marine life as very few people have before. I don't know about you, but I want to ride in one. Phoenix also has a mini-sub that allows passengers to travel between the yacht and the surface seamlessly. How much cooler can it get? Check the sock drawer because she only costs a meager $85 million. Slam that like and subscribe button now and that $85 million will show up in your mailbox within a week. 
This one has got to be one of the most badass looking yachts on the water. The Adastra was created by McConaughey Boats and was launched into the Pearl River near Zhuhai, China in 2012. Adastra was designed with the Power Trimaran three-hull design in order to smoothly cut through the high seas. Her deck spans across the three hulls to ensure ample space, but she's got some brawn to go with her beauty. At a cost of about 15 million to build, she has a superstructure that's largely made out of carbon fiber and fitted with a Nomex honeycomb core. She comes equipped with three engines, two Yanmar 110 horse outrigger engines, along with a single Caterpillar C18 engine putting out about 1150 horsepower. On top of that, Adastra was designed for fuel efficiency without sacrificing speed, creating a lightweight vessel with lower fuel consumption with a top speed of about 23 knots. She can accommodate up to nine guests along with the six crew members. Looks like a fun ride. More awesomeness, another yacht slash sub. Must be a new trend. The Migaloo M5 is a 443-foot private yacht that also doubles as a private submarine. This enormous piece of technology can stay underwater for several weeks at a time, allowing its passengers to experience life underwater for longer periods of time rather than just a brief tour. Wow, just wow. The designers over at Migaloo even offer new owners submersible yachts customized to their specifications, with all the bells and whistles, including a pool on the surface and even a helipad. Also, the interior is the height of lavishness and design. The Migaloo M5 accommodates about 24 to 36 guests. Due to customizable options, these yachts range into the billions, with estimates reaching as high as $2.3 billion. This is one cool-looking high-tech catamaran. With her sleek lines and black carbon fiber hull, Nemesis 1 glides on top of the water in exquisite beauty. She's what's known as a foil sailing yacht. In other words, she moves across the open sea at crazy speeds as she sits on top of computer-controlled hydrofoils. At 332 feet and her super strong hull, she's the fastest luxury foiling yacht in the world at a blistering speed of 50 knots, which is practically unheard of. On top of her incredible speed, she's equipped with state-of-the-art smart laser radar sensors, enabling Nemesis to map the safest route. What's more, she's been designed for easy, convenient operation with strategic push-button controls all over her to keep things simple for the crew. Yet, we still have more. Nemesis 1 is also outfitted with an ocean wing sail that automatically adjusts the angle for maximum efficiency. Still, there's more. The interior layout of the yacht is nearly fully customizable, allowing for the yacht to be perfectly designed to owner specifications. When Nemesis 1 hits the water, Jaws will surely drop with her crazy speeds, comfortable, luxurious, and smooth sailing abilities, and sleek, badass looks. We've saved one of the best for last. Check it out. Pagarus is quite unique as in she's an amphibious catamaran, meaning she can traverse land as well as water. Designed by Italian designer Lazzarini, She's something truly impressive with her special rotating cylinders that are found on the underside of the catamaran. As she touches down on land, these cylinders descend and dig into the ground as they rotate, moving the vessel through the sand, mud, and other soft terrains. On the water, though, Pagarus is propelled by two stern-drive propellers powered by dual diesel engines, putting out a whopping 890 horsepower, hitting speeds of up to 24 knots. But what about the interior? The living area inside Pagarus is divided between the two hulls of the ship, and a reinforced steel bridge connects the two. With plenty of space, the hulls can be designed to fit up to three bedrooms, a restroom, and even a kitchen. On top of that, she can accommodate up to eight passengers and four crew members. As an added bonus, the catamaran's bridge, which also serves as the helm station, includes a platform connected to four winches designed to load various vehicles onto the yacht. As of now, Lazzarini's Pagaris can be built on demand, with prices starting at a paltry $24 million. That $24 million could be yours, but only if you watch another one of our videos.